Good morning students. Today we're going to finish unit 7 by talking about the review and <clears throat> inshallah tomorrow we're going to start unit number 8. Let's eat healthy. You're going to find this uh, review on page 75 in your student book. We're going to read it. I'm going to explain the questions, you're going to solve it, and I'm going to post the ideal answers on the link that I will be sending to your parents tomorrow. A place where fire or heat has hurt your skin. What is the word? What is the word that sounds a place where fire or heat has hurt your skin? We talked about it. It's some kind of an injury. It's not a cut. It's not a bruise. It has to do something with fire or heat. Question number two. Who do the children help in the story? Remember the story when the kids took a first aid uh, course and on their way home, something happened and they helped someone. Who did they help? Number three. Circle the correct word in this sentence. Please put on or put off your jacket. It's cold today. We took these phrasal verbs and their meanings. You can find them throughout the unit. What is putting on or putting off your jacket? Which one do we use? Do we use on or off? Complete the sentence. We don't like playing basketball. Ball, I'm sorry, said the boys. The boys said that they, we, turned into they, as we explained in yesterday's lesson, do not becomes, what does it become? If do is verb one, what is verb two of do? And what do we do to the verb after? playing basketball. Complete the sentences. My dad's working today, said Carl. Carl said his dad is, you're gonna, I'm sorry for the mistakes, you're gonna find it written on your book, page 75, uh, question number five. Is turns into what? And what do we do to the verb following it? This is Present continuous, it turns into past continuous. How does the sentence become? Six, complete the sentences. We're going to the park tomorrow, said the children. The children said they, we, are, becomes they, what? This is verb to be. Again, this is present continuous turns into past continuous they were going to the park the next day who did Rob and Jenny rescue in the fire in the day a day in the life of, of a firefighter we talked about the firefighter Jenny and who did they re rescue they rescued two people who are they verb to teach people how to do something. What is the word that means to teach people how to do something? When we teach people uh, how to use first aids, what is the word? Last two questions are the writing questions. Write I for introduction or C for conclusion. We're just going to remind you that introduction means the beginning of a newspaper article. Conclusion means the ending, al-khulasa, of a newspaper article. Police officer Christopher Harris said that Toby was a very brave boy. He's the kind of person we need in the police force, he said. A 12-year-old boy stopped a man from stealing a shop in the town center yesterday. Okay, so one of these sentences is an introduction and one of, it, one of them is a conclusion. 
we said we can differentiate very easily. One of them, we said the introduction or the conclusion always contains quotations. Someone is always saying something. Which one? Think. Write I for introduction or C for conclusion. Ten year old students, Karen Wells saved a little boy saved a little boy's life when he fell into the river. Karen said she was glad the boy was safe. I hope he won't play near the river again. One of them is an introduction, the other is a conclusion. Think very wisely. Solve them alone. Reply this video. Solve them alone. Page 75 and I will be posting the answers shortly. Good luck. See you tomorrow.